हे माई नेम इज हैप्पी आई हेल्प कैंडिडेट्स इन डॉट नेट इंटरव्यू प्रिपरेशन आफ्टर वॉचिंग दिस वीडियो यू विल बी एबल टू आंसर दिस क्वेश्चन इन एनी इंटरव्यू इफ यू हैव एनी कन्फ्यूजन इन एनी इंटरव्यू क्वेश्चन देन पोस्ट इन द कमेंट सेक्शन एंड आई विल मेक एन वीडियो ऑन इट सो लेट्स स्टार्ट विद दिस क्वेश्चन तो एक्सेस स्पेसिफायर एंड एक्सेस मोडिफायर आर द सेम थिंग नाउ हेयर इज द सिंपलेस्ट डेफिनेशन विच इज इजी टू रिमेंबर एंड इजी टू स्पीक इन द फ्रंट ऑफ द इंटरव्यूअर Access specifiers are keywords to specify the accessibility of a class, method, property, and field. So it basically defines the accessibility of the class, method, property, and fields. The keywords are public, private, protected, internal, and protected internal. Out of these, first three are very important. Then internal and protected internal are related to the assemblies. Let me show you in this table. so here is a table that tells where these keywords are accessible and where not for example public is accessible at every level it is accessible in the same class uh, for example if it is a method and if it it's a public method then this method is available in the same class inside the derived class of uh, the base class like if the method is present in the base class then this public method is also pres uh, accessible in the derived class of that base class okay in other codes also it is accessible and even it is accessible in another assembly now just a note here an assembly can have multiple classes so this public method will be available in other assemblies also and in that derived classes of the assembly so again for example if you have one assembly and inside that there is a class a and there is another assembly and inside that there is a class b now this b class b is derived from the class a but they are in two different assemblies so this last case sorry this this second last case inside the derived class but that is in another assembly is the same uh, case okay so this is about the public uh, access uh, specifier which is accessible at every level the next one is private now private is accessible or available within the same class same class and nowhere else right all uh, like inside derived class it's not accessible other code other assembly derived class of assembly it is not accessible then we have this internal case now internal if you will put a method internal then it will be accessible within the uh, same class within the derived class other code also but it will not be accessible inside any other assembly so last two cases are for the other assembly so this internal will not be accessible in any other assembly it will be accessible inside the same assembly only then we have this protected a uh, protected is accessible in the same class and it is accessible in the child or derived class also but it will not be accessible anywhere else even the derived class is in the another assembly still this protected method will be accessible over there so that is also not a problem but uh, otherwise it will not then we have this uh, last one is this protected internal now protected internal is accessible within all the classes of the same assembly so this first three are in the same assembly and protected internal accessible here but it will be only accessible in the derived class of the second assembly which i will say another assembly so these are all the xx specifiers uh, out of like public and out of these uh, public private and protected as i said are very important and frequently used internal and protected internal are related to assembly so they are not so frequently used but yes um, it's good to know them now the next part of the question is what is the default access modifier in a class uh, do not get confused again access specifier and access modifier are same things so here in the code like uh, there is the class right we have written the class here but we have missed the access specifier right here so what will be what will be the default access specifier which dotnet framework will apply here and the answer is internal internal is the default access specifier or modifier of a class so that is the answer of this question i hope you understand it
and if you have any queries regarding this question then please let me know in the comment section